Right, hello everybody, welcome to Norse Country game number 6, down 230 TV against Lizards, that means um, Cheney, which is alright. And he's got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, only 5 Saurus. And he's 3, 3, 3, 3. And 3, 3, 3, 3, 3 with Lizard Men is like... Zero 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 nine on another race. <laughs> not the not the lizards require, you know, zero percent effort or anything. But um, oh dear. just kill the skinks. Easy, isn't it? Yeah, just easily murder all of the skinks. Just murderize things. But got 14 players now with Cheney, that's alright, isn't it? And, uh. Clawlosauruses! Yeah, that's, that's certainly what we'll endeavor to, uh. to do. To achieve with Cheney here. You will hopefully smash some Sauruses' balls out. Uh, hopefully I'll get the foul on turn one, yes. I will, like, I will foul if I'm able to. Because they don't have thick skull, do they? The sauruses. So, um... <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he must be new. Don't get a blitz. Skink swarm. It could happen. Blitz the skinks. They will instantly die. So safe. Reddit. How did this happen? I do not understand. I don't really want to hit the uh, the crocs here, but I might have to. Well, I'll see if I get the chance. Alright then. This allows a bit more pressure down the side, but that's okay, I guess, isn't it? Let's fucking do this. Thick skull, though, is pretty stupid, but he is strength 5 and he's got block. And he's more assists as well. There you go, sent off for a stun. 
Right, never again. I'm going to sack that dirty player. It's hard when everyone you play just fucking cazzes somebody every foul they make, isn't it? And then you just make one. Sent off, bribe, fail. The last time I foul, this time. Make a foul, sent off. Jesus fucking Christ. It's mostly linemen, yeah. <laughs> I do hate Norse, but I'm going I'm through. Find everyone who plays Norse in real life. I'm going through the races I haven't played. I look fucking life. Before uh, Blood Bowl 3 comes out. And, uh. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm going to do. Oh, wonderful. Let's go for the frenzy trap, 1D. The old, ye old 1D frenzy trap. That's rowdy for even for Norse, isn't it? Fuck it. What would Space Cadet do? <laughs> what? Just ask yourself, what would Space Cadet do? <laughs> That's probably the wrong question to ask about anything, really. <laughs> In any situation, if that's the if that's the question you're asking yourself, you probably don't want to. You probably don't want to go with the answer that you get. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> That sounds like very Space cadet here. Yeah. I mean, I'm going for the not protecting the ball at all. Which is, you know... Okay, the ball isn't protected. On the other side of the pitch, as Space Cadet would have it. But, it is it's not in a cage. I'm halfway there. Daddy. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> Vomit on his sweater already, Space Cadetti. It's a fucking shithead skink, just so I can punch with uh, Cheney, I think so. Ooh, 
come on, Kazin. No, oh, why didn't it work? This works for Space Cadet. Why won't it work for me? No, Space Cadet would have powered him there. Actually, have the guy there. I could have just made it a 2D. No, I couldn't because he was there. Yeah, no, that's alright. Right. Oh, I can't get knocked over. I've got the ball and the blodger. So I might as well just run forward like a mad cunt. Now I'm getting full space to get Wasted a reroll. The ball is needlessly exposed. Surely nothing can go wrong now. <laughs> where's the snow troll? Yeah, where is everything? It's here. Here is, here is the good thing about Norse. The one good player on the Norse team. There he is. Exactly, Tony, yeah. There's a reason. There's a reason that uh, Space Cadet gets to moan about Blodge more than anyone else. <laughs> it's not because he gets powered an unrealistic amount. It's because he gets punched an unrealistic amount. I wonder if he's going to foul and kill Cherny now. That would be pretty fun, wouldn't it? I think he's almost certainly going to foul it. <laughs> and almost certainly going to cast it, yeah. <laughs> After my instant fucking send off for a stun. He's probably going to cast no send off. 14, including Cheney. But no, I'm already down on 10 this drive, though. And there goes the best player. There goes my best player, no send off. Classic. Now I've got absolutely nothing, just a team of hobgoblins against a team with strength four everywhere. KO's better because now he can fail two KO rolls. I'll probably just one because I won't score. Like it seems alright, doesn't it? You maybe do the regen of the cars, so this way. It's where you just don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know or care what to do. To be honest. Can you punch me there? Yeah. Good. I could concede and play a real team. I 
think maybe I shouldn't do this idea that I had. <laughs> I think maybe this idea that I'd, you know, I didn't play these teams for a reason. <laughs> There's a reason I didn't play all these races. Maybe I shouldn't play them. do need some games, so I guess better, better, better to get them in early than late. I don't feel very good today though, so maybe I should just spin the roller doors if I'm feeling good. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Jillio. At least I expect these fucking armor 7 fucks to get removed every time they're punched. Yeah, it'll be very similar, yeah. Yeah, it'd be very similar. Well, I look at Tom, I think it's probably... Probably gonna be a... Uh, fucking... Goblins, I think, isn't it? Let's have a look. Yeah, Goblins too ahead of Camry. Goblins at the moment. Uh, no, a nine wide. No, no, they're definitely not. They're making it worse, if anything, <laughs> or better, depending on your point of view. In theory, but if you if you know how to play Blood Bowl and you've read the rules, <laughs> you can confidently say that um, Bash is more powerful. Well, particularly non-claw Bash is more powerful. I'm going to do some Space Cadet levels of ball protection here. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Classic J. Hey! How could it have been anything else? Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Just needed a 2 plus, you know, it chains away the, it chains away the fucking dude and then we've got two players free to protect the ball. Can that work? Can it fuck? <sighs> I mean, obviously I'm in a bad spot. Like, I didn't do it just for fun. Obviously in a horrible spot against Lizardmen. Um, I thought that was a way to maybe get enough to do something. Hello, Andrew. Yeah, Claw teams are absolutely fucked, but it's still going to be. I mean, they, they, I know Claw, Chaos will pretty much play it before, but Orcs will continue to be the most played race, I imagine. Even if the animosity will confuzzle new players when they all of a sudden can't pass. They'll <laughs> be like, what the hell's going on? <laughs> and I guess dwarves will probably be played more. Yet he would not be useful here, Tom Schneers. It would roll a 1 every single turn. As you've just seen, my uh, Berserker instantly rolled a 1. The only time he was called upon to roll a one, he rolled double ones. So, uh, it's safe to say that Yeti would have done absolutely fuck all. Also, Cheney failed to break armor and then was fouled out. Which is probably what would have happened to the Yeti as well if he hadn't failed every absolutely everything. Right, well now we've somehow got a chance here. 
Maybe I shouldn't re-roll that because <laughs> all of a sudden, somehow, somehow this guy has given us a chance. Oh, I misclick as the camera moved. Are you shitting me? Jesus fucking Christ. Fuck cyanide, honestly. Oh, God, they're the worst, aren't they? How can you make a game this fucking badly? Jesus Christ. God, like, how is that a thing? How is that a fucking thing that happens? I did blitz a skink, he was unharmed. Um, meanwhile, we've had three players removed. Yeah, it depends whether there's a redraft or not. Where goes the line? It's all you know. It's all up in the air because we just literally don't know if there's even going to be a redraft. So you know, anything's possible with Sino. Wait, time's out and I'm gonna make this dodge. Oh no, he's just gonna blitz, oh, alright. Blitzing gives us a GFI, doesn't it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So I've got I've still got a dodge anyway. Oh, that was the one in nine. Genius. Does have the old skink swarm available here? Not much I can do about that. Bit of a daft thing to come out with there, look, Tom.
The election won't be finalized in court. No, look, it, we, look, here's, here's the election. Goblins were winning by two. Now they're only winning by one. Kemri. Kemri coming up from behind. Who were misses. <laughs> Tom is <that's> very good. <laughs> yeah, he's blew it by not voting for Cam. Oh, <laughs> maybe Tony, yeah, maybe. I like how he hasn't failed a 3 plus star jersey, but I probably will. I like, got away with one already. Probably fail the second one. Oh wow, this is crazy. Kind of crazy it made the double GFI. He could have easily had to use a reroll on that and then not be able to reroll the hit. Doesn't get him anywhere. Look at Blodge doing things. Amazing. Amazing bit of bludgery. Glorious. Hey, <laughs> thanks for eating those dice. Right, that's interesting. That for, that whole that gets another player free, doesn't it? I think I still just think I punch him though. GFI. Simple GFI. Five times out of six. Woohoohoo! It actually worked. Unfucking believable. Perfect turn eight stall. Of course, Cheney stays out. You see, that's why he got KO'd instead of Kaz. Just for the fucking hope of him. Just to give me that fucking little oh, bit of hope. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking comeback. Oh god. That's why he got oh, fucking god. KO'd. Oh yeah. A little bit of fucking hope just to kill me. And then he can fail a fucking 75% to come back instead of a 50 50 from the car, see? That's what it was. Fucking Cheney's a real dick, isn't he? See, look, keeping up with American politics there. Done absolutely nothing to the uh, lizards. <laughs> Ruined. Lost my best player. <laughs> Hello, HTK. Hello, Foxamania. Oh, God, I hate those. <laughs> Really fucking hate them. <laughs> Bludge put in some work there, though, didn't it? He'd have been knocked over like two or three times without dodge. That was that was pretty good.
And I think he uh, the dodge gave him the rule on the dodge out as well, so it was real good value from dodge there. Oh, Kenry's are ahead now. Kenry's up to 19. I do have a best player Eric behind me. I have the guy who isn't a Norse. <laughs> I have this, this incredible player who isn't a Norse. <laughs> He's brilliant, isn't he? He's really brilliant. And I got a good couple of turns out of him as well. Maybe even three turns. And he didn't break armor once. And then he was KO'd and stayed out for the whole match. Probably. I can't see him coming back. So if I have the LOS so far... Woo. Block being a defensive skill, very nice. Bad, wasn't it? He? he pushed him away from an extra block. He should have, uh, should have either made the 3D block first or uh, blitzed him back so he could still get another one. Right now. Oh no, Moradan. It's alright, at least you made some dodges and get, didn't get knocked over. Could be worse. Just think to yourself, it could always be worse. <laughs> That's true of like. About 7 billion people on Earth, isn't it? That it could be worse. <laughs> so you've got that going for you. <laughs> Looks like Cheney wasn't amongst them. Yep, of course he stayed out. Just of course he did. Like there was any fucking doubt. And alright, I had a friend who acted like he was the least fortunate man on earth um, because he wasn't very good at Blood Bowl of 40k and uh, he blamed the dice for, for his failings and because of that he claimed to be the most unluckiest person on earth which I thought was, you know, moderately hilarious Blood Bowl and 40k. <laughs> I'm like, just by being born in England, that makes you one of the fucking luckiest people on earth, doesn't it? <laughs> really? Hello, Hallis. Um, I, don't, I don't know if it's a winning streak, but not losing, which is good. Could always be Norse. Very good. Very good. Let <laughs> me picture myself as a gym. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> no, but it's still it's still just luck, isn't it, where you're born, like it's weird, isn't it, like your consciousness and stuff, but being just born in like England makes you luckier than like about ninety percent of the earth, doesn't it? Like, you know, any Western country, you know like America. Germany, France. <laughs> Parents got lucky now. It is, yeah, but I mean, Brexit hadn't happened at the time that he was whining, you know, 10 years ago. <laughs> yeah, more dumb, yeah. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? 
And like, I'll be honest with you, I'm not going to get banned off fumble or anything for this, but uh, he was losing on fumble, so I took over, and I couldn't, I, I couldn't save the game. And he said, "See, even you can't win with my dice." And I'm like, "No, it's because <laughs> it's because you had played so badly. <laughs> you got yourself in one un unsalvageable position, <laughs> and he didn't, he didn't like that. <laughs> he didn't like that." <laughs> no, because you're probably not allowed to play in somebody else's account. It wasn't Gian. No, no, he's he's pretty smart, Gian. Although he was also terrible. At... Yeah, this guy is a bit of a you know bit of an idiot. Uh, whereas Gian is pretty smart, just bad at bad at. Video game, not bad at video games, bad at like tabletop games. Lord of Dice, oh man. I yeah, know, right? Bonehead actually working out. Incredible. Incredible. Oh, I fucking just put it in the wrong place. Well, that was smart, wasn't it? I can't blame the uh, shitty, uh, the shitty bloody UI or anyone. Yeah, UI for that kind of. I just fuck. I just frenzy trap. Fuck it. Let's go. Full Norse. Easy. I don't know. It's a bit of both. It's a bit of both physics. It's not just risk management, is it? Um, it's not just risk management. That is that is a, a gross oversimplification. Um, it's definitely elements of both. Yeah, like failure state, like equity maximization to turn into die off for a second. Stuff like that, isn't it? It's not just mitigating risk and failure states. Sometimes you've got to accept a worse failure, potentially for worse failure state for a higher payoff if you have to and stuff like that, isn't it? <laughs> if you're playing Woody's or Rats, it's a clicking game. <laughs> I like that. I like that, Tony. <laughs> Leaving Cheney out for the one turn. Oh, what, are you, what are you on about, Chelio? Oh, right, yeah, because he's going to come back for the one turn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. He'll probably fail then as well. Yeah, building the team strategic, yeah, for sure. For sure. Oh, come off it. You absolute fucking idiot. I mean, I don't think this is a great decision. Hopefully he'll get punished for it. Oh, he was. Good. I could have just blocked him. But I wanted to hit with my E-blow. That was pretty terrible, wasn't it? That was pretty terrible. Um, I'm just going to stand these guys up. Let him punch me for a turn, see what happens. China resents not being included as a superpower. What's this from? Squirrel. Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't understand it either. Behind me. Well, I mean, again, you can understand it if you feel like you're the underdog, and you've got to make something happen. Like get get lucky and make something happen. Hello, Doctor Satisfying. Good afternoon, Alva. Uh, no strategy kit. Actually, whoa. Now let's see. Is it exclamation point leaks? Let's find out. It is exclamation point leaks. There's a playlist of mine and uh, Skuro Metzl's videos about Blood Bowl 2020. Blood Bowl 2020 is a new tabletop board game. And Blood Bowl 3 is going to follow those rules supposedly to the letter. So there you go. Um, risky, <laughs> risky click of the day. <laughs> oh, baby. Might be able to get a tackler on, on the ball here. <laughs> yes, cool, yes. But supposedly this time, you know, um, Games Workshop care more about making... Because they didn't, you know, when they when they made Blood Bowl 1 and 2, uh, CRP was like, you know, Blood Bowl was like dead and CRP was all there was. Whereas now that they've made the new edition, um, that's no longer the case. And... You know, they want it to, they want them to not fuck everything up, basically, I think is the, uh, is the idea. Alright, the, the AV7 held up from that turn. Now, hopefully there can be some kind of a payoff. And, uh... Good things can happen. You can be my wingman anytime. Bullshit. No, oh, Jakala. Thank you very much, Jakala. Oh, I even got the power there. Welcome, Jakala viewers. Thank you for the raid. And uh, Glorious is doing a wonderful game of. Horrible fucking Norse here. Worst team in the game, bar none. Um, <laughs> hope you enjoy seeing shit like this. <laughs> um. <laughs> right, I'm going to punch him because then that gives us another 2D. Just kill, killing the skinks there, just like Reddit tells me to. Fantastic. Oh, get banged on. That's pretty good, isn't it? This, these two now make the reverse pretty difficult. And these three make the potato not so good. So, there's a chance. There's a chance. Tell me there's a chance. <laughs> Worst team frustrated coach and seen at each chat. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, Mama Bosco. <laughs> Indeed, yeah, Running Dragon, yeah, but I think the point is not making up their own stupid stuff more than, you know, like like for Blood Bowl 2, they made up the bank rule, they made up um, the inducement system, they made up um, more expensive off blitzers, they made up better AV human catchers. So they just thought of loads of idiotic things and they made up stadium enhancements. So they so they like they made up loads of dumb shit for the uh, Blood Bowl too. So I think 
So I think <laughs> not fucking it up by making loads of additional shit is uh, is probably, you know, more of a concern than uh, making sure that they include the price to nuffle table or whatever. Alright, at least he's not so oh, he'd already blitzed. The potato is very much in play, isn't it? And he will get 2D. Or maybe not. If he makes this dodge and GFI, he will not be 2D. He could get a skink surf, though. He makes the dodge play. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, what's this? Hey! I don't know about that so much, Strad EK. I just think it's people who don't know about Blood Bowl, isn't it? Like, which is fair enough. Why should they know or care about Blood Bowl? It doesn't make any sense, does it? Like, you know, if you make civilization, like, you know, like, you know, if you know what, what civil who's civilization made by? I don't know, or XCOM or anything, but if, if you make Civilization, like if you're the company that makes Civilization, Activision, I don't fucking know, it, let's, let's pretend Activision makes Civilization, then they've created all of the mechanics, haven't they? Yeah, Sid Mylan, Sid, Sid, he's created Firaxis, there you go, um, he, Firaxis have created all of the mechanics, so they fucking know what they do, and and like why they have those mechanics, don't they? But if you haven't made the mechanics, then you know it's you know <laughs> exactly, Pablo. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> like it just doesn't make sense to to care about the rule set whatsoever. Like to know anything, <laughs> why should they know anything? Break. <laughs> it doesn't make any expen any sense to expect them to know anything. I think maybe stop the reverse. Would still be a consideration. We'll go for the uh, base with tackle there. Unlikely to work. But if it does, it's nice. Alright, we've got the tackle base. Unlikely to work or achieve anything, but there you go. You can punch him as well. <laughs> Me. But, you know, you can't expect them to understand it, though, can you, Pablo? You can't expect them to understand it to the extent that they're making it. You know, they haven't made it, have they? That's the point. You know, it, like, you know, um, there's people who've played Blood Bowl for years, and they're still garbage at it, and still don't understand the mechanics or why why things exist and stuff, do they? Whereas if you've made the, all the mechanics, like Firaxis have made Civilization, they know why those mechanics are there. Don't they? You know, like, that's the thing. <laughs> well, Jervis might, might need Jelly, although I did see his mind explode when I was a 14-year-old child. <laughs> Feel attacked. Sorry, sorry, Ali Raider. Wait, you're back to. Didn't you change from Ali Raider to something else? And are you back to Ali Raider now? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely, Tony. Look, I'm not. I'm not trying to big up myself at all by saying that, but it's just true, isn't it? That like you can't expect the the company that hasn't made the game to uh, to know like what makes the game successful or good or anything because they haven't made it. Whereas. Thoraxis or whatever should understand because they've actually made the game. He's rolled some dice here, hasn't he? But uh, this could, he could come unstuck from the stall here. Oh, 
<laughs> well, it's not that crazy, is it? Got two dice on him, but you know, what if I, what if I fail? Do I re-roll it? No, because I can't afford to not have the re-roll on offense. And he might be able to make the dodges to protect it as well. Like, you know, to be fair to this guy, he hasn't failed a dodge in his life, so... He probably doesn't realise that it's possible. See? stall even but he, 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 man, he managed to didn't he It is better play than I would have expected from somebody who's 333 with lizards. No offence. Come on, Cheney. Yes! And Christ for that. Right, now he's got nine players, still got the full eleven. Maybe he should have tried a foul at some point. Thanks, <laughs> <Stradiki. laughs> Just push him into the end zone. Right. It's too good. Oh, look, Harvey's got the crocs. Okay, we definitely don't go croc side, do we? That seems like the wrong way to go. Hopefully no, um, hopefully no uh, blitz. It's good that you put the crocs and the uh, block guy on the same side. Oh good, well, that was helpful. Fuck me. This turn and next turn, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, fuck off. Hello, oh, Rick. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> this is horrible, isn't it? This is just horrible. Oh, now we get a heavy break from Cheney. Now that it's too fucking late. Well done, Cheney, you dick. God, I've got a 1D to tag the Crocs. And double GFI hand off to him next turn. Potentially. Get up there. Ho oh, ho ho, yes! All the removals now. Glorious. Well, now it looks pretty good, now that he's down to seven players. Some actual removals. Outrageous. Mind that he's in the way, isn't it? Mm. 
Those are probably hanging in there, literally. <laughs> oh, pranks to vanish. Pretty bad, actually. Pretty bad. I need to, um... I need to make an appointment to sort out my toes. I've got too many toes. <laughs> oh god, he's gonna one D. Come on, fail a dodge. One time. Fail me a dodge, buddy. <laughs> Good old cyanide pathing. Like that's, they've got to improve the pathing, haven't they? There's no need to not go di diagonally around. It's it's always amazing the cyanide pathing when, when things like this. Come on, fail one of these dodges. Nope. It's got your feet as well. Him, I guess. But then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and I've got to be eight away. You can't really do much. As you can tag. I guess I should push them further away. Just not matter. Yeah, and now the punch on him is difficult, isn't it? Because he would be basing Cheney. Uh. And his only Cheney is the only scoring threat. So he's got five plus dodge to hit Cheney. Mark Cheney. I guess he could blitz to Mark Cheney. So yeah, I guess I should have. Uh, I should have. One of these guys should have run down there. I guess this guy. This guy should have just run down the field to have a second scoring threat. Now whether he will go for the only. Oh God! There was it. Put. I left a chain on there, didn't I? Skin could have moved up and he could have chained, uh, chained the Crocs free. That was pretty stupid. Luckily he didn't see it. But I was thinking of letting him not blitz and base. But got a bit too one-track minded there. Nice. Lorna fail please. Yes. Well I did that last game. And... It 
fail, but I guess I should have done. But the thing is, I don't want to have to pick it up again, do I? At least this time it's eight times out of nine. It works. Whereas if I've got to pick it up again on the next turn, and plus he could have intercepted. Two, three, four, five. There's no need to knock him down. There is a need to knock the skink down. Hey. Well done, Tony. You stop being shit. There's no point blocking, it doesn't achieve anything, does it? Just the handoff. Catch worked. Wonderful. Whew. <laughs> GG, easy. <laughs> Thanks, Rick. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, it was pretty great that he came back, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, oranges, that's true. That's true, isn't it? Glorious. <laughs> I saw a real rough three. Doesn't work. Oh, I was just thought, well, my Saurus leveled. I just naturally assumed I wasn't the fucking Norse team. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! <laughs> oh. Naturally, naturally treated this guy as the enemy. <laughs> I was like, "Whoa, I've killed the skill of the Saurus." <laughs> oh dear me! That was something, wasn't it? His dodges, eighty-two percent. That's pretty good, isn't it? Edge four skins, pretty good. 30, 20, 24 is block dice with crap. 30, 28, 22 block dice with crap. Dodges were amazing. Edge 4, Edge 4 Norse. Glorious. <laughs> Jump up double one, not so good. Yeah, they're pushing the end zone. Yeah, gave us the chance and the rerolls that weren't needed. Alright, two level ups. Two level ups. That's a panning on guy. And a sure hands guy. Oh, a guard guy. I mean, almost certainly. I'll think about it for a second, but almost certainly guard. And then maybe get another runner to be the ball carrier. Right, 4 2 0. Beautiful. Um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.